afternoon YouTube and welcome back to the channel it's a hot one today it's the 16th of June it's about half eight in the morning and it's already 19 degrees I've had a short walk from the car uh, to where I'm gonna pitch this tent and I'm already sweating so I was lucky enough to be sent a tent from a company called Nightcat uh, a couple of months ago um, I've been using it over the last couple of months, used it probably about four or five times. I uh, wanted to get some good use out of it before I gave my honest thoughts on what I think of it. So I've come up to my kind of local nature reserve to get the tent pitched and we'll run through some uh, specs as I do so. so. I'll just find somewhere to pitch it and I'll bring you back in a second. So the tent itself comes in this stuff sack has two straps either side so you can press it down even further than that and that will take up hardly any room in your pack. It also comes with 10 pegs or stakes. They're pretty good. And it also comes with an instruction manual. As you can see, it's a lovely looking tent. It only weighs 950 grams. Obviously you do need to bring a trekking pole to erect the tent. I've set that pole at 130. I've seen others set it at 125. But I don't think it makes a great deal of difference. Obviously I haven't guided out yet. But there is hardly any wind today. Where it's guide out, that's all reinforced. You don't need to seam seal it so you don't have any nasty looking white seams as you do on some of the lanchans. It sits quite far off the ground at the front so you get quite a lot of ventilation coming up through. And inside I'm six foot and I can um, lay down without touching the sides. The inner does sag a little bit, but it's not a problem for, for one night. I wouldn't like to do multiple days in this tent because it is a little bit kind of cozy. Big enough vestibule, you'd be able to get a 50, 60 litre bag in there. No problem at all. So yeah, bathtub floor, it's a good tent. So as I said, I've used this tent over the last couple of months and I like it. Doesn't weigh very much, fits in your bag quite easily, doesn't take up any room. Yeah, I'd recommend it. So I hope you found that review useful. There are loads of reviews on YouTube um, about this tent. It's the uh, Nightcat ultralight backpacking tent for one person. Decent tent. Thanks for watching and I will catch you on the next one.